my goodness, October is the warmest start to October on record. We've been 12 and a half degrees above average. <laughs> Gotta love it. Yesterday we were nine degrees above our average temperature. We had a high of 68 degrees. Fond du Lac, where that pumpkin is, 71 was your high temperature yesterday. Feeling pretty good. It's also been kind of a muggy fall, to be honest with you. Dew points have been in the 60s for 13 of the first 14 days this month. Now we're finally dropping down to those crisp fall like feel like commit conditions and humidity as well. So right now temperatures are anywhere from 15 to nearly 30 degrees cooler than we were this time yesterday morning. That cold front has arrived. We're looking at clear skies and plummeting temperatures of 41 degrees when you step outside here into Green Bay, 43 into Appleton. But look up at the North Woods, 32 into Mountain. You have now hit that freezing mark. There is definitely going to be frost out there. I hope you brought in your sensitive plants overnight. Now those winds moving out of the northwest at three to six miles per hour. A breezy a little bit along the lake shore, but the rest of us aren't really feeling that just yet. Clear skies have allowed those temperatures to crash so low. We actually want the clouds through the overnight, but are on their way here as we head through this afternoon. That rain tracking from Iowa is riding along this low pressure system that's going to lift up in towards northern Illinois today. So starting off clear, clouds arriving right around 10 to 11 o'clock this morning. Chances for some scattered sprinkles through our lunch hour. Then we clear back out again to more sunshine and a brighter end to our Friday. Woohoo! Well, tomorrow we do have a chance for a few more scattered sprinkles and clouds as the system heads into Canada. It will wrap around a little bit of a disturbance here and some stronger winds picking up gusting to 25 miles per hour tomorrow. So as that pushes away through the afternoon and for the rest of the weekend, high pressure builds and cool air continues to stick here with us. So starting off bright and beautiful tomorrow, a few clouds rolling in around eight in the morning, sticking with us through our lunch hour with chances of a few scattered sprinkles. But then we clear on out to a beautiful Saturday as well. Now Northwoods pay attention overnight for the entire weekend. Temperatures dropping down to those low 30s there, so we are looking at that frost likely out there. Now, in terms of temperatures, as we go through the rest of October, we're going to be average. And then in terms of precipitation, we're looking at below normal. So a little bit drier, cooler period headed our way with highs today climbing to the upper 50s to low 60s. Then tonight crashing back down to the low 40s to some 30s as well with partly cloudy skies. And then tomorrow temperatures back to just like today into the upper 50s, but it's going to be breezier, a lot windier. So it's actually going to have some wind chill factored in there. Unfortunately, it's going be feeling a little bit cooler tomorrow than today. Sunday, though, we're going to go into those low 60s for the Packers game, which are going to crush the Bears, aren't they? As we go into next week, beautiful sunshine, temperatures getting pretty warm again. Tuesday, we could hit 70. <laughs> Thank goodness, because today was so cold. So how's tomorrow going to be colder? A little bit cooler because that wind, unfortunately, it's going to be pesky. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs>